are kicking off on Paramount Plus and CBS Sports alongside Matteo Bonetti. To the sixth in his first season, then second, then champions. It's lifted in, it's in. and it's snuck in by Udinese. Rodrigo Picao celebrates, and the very first corner kick of the season produces the opening goal. Manian's goal. Look at the movement here from the Bacau. It's at the New York Post. He's in front of his marker. He just sneaks in front of Ante Rebic at the last moment. And Manian is stunned. Manian had a central position in goal, but that New York Post was beckoning. And that is a defensive howl or in the first. For the taking. Man, it's not the best piece of goalkeeping. Sylvester just leaves it on the golden platter. But look, his Calabria is about to reach in. And seemingly it's happened. He's about ready to celebrate, but right as he's about to poke it in, he doesn't make clean contact with the ball. You're not going to see it too well from this end. All eyes on Paninelli, waiting for the referee's whistle. So Hernandez from 12 paces out levels it for Milan. Early goals. Back to square one, it's all tied in San Siro. Going the right, the wrong direction, right there at the last second. As he's staring him down the entire time. That's a really well taken penalty. Full of confidence. One of Milan's best players last season. And what a whirlwind, 10 minutes in. Our voices are nearly gone. This latter half of last year, Kalulu filling in. In central defense. Alongside Tomori. Fancy feet for Brian Diaz. Calabria. It's a good delivery for Rebe! Struck it as it came! Struck sweetly! Milan 2, Udinese 1! The footwork right here just to continue the play on right there. That little ball roll. Gets by two defenders, feeds it to Calabria, was making that overlapping run, and this is a pinpoint cross. He's got about four players there just stopping their run, and he's able to just thread the needle right in between Pereira and Night Tank. There's a channel straight to Revage. Success. Pereira. It's the overlap from Bacao lifted into the 18th. To tax! Oh, and it's all level! The unlikeliest of goal scorers, Adam Mazina. Roberto Pereira just picks his spot. Look at him, he stands still. And in the final second, just like what we saw, it's that run at the last second in front of the marker. This time it's Junior Macias who's beaten far too easily. Calabria is occupied already. So that is Macias, the furthest man back. And Mazina just slips in front of him at the final second. It's a brilliant diving header. I mean, the pinpoint accuracy, just to steer that one into the bottom corner. Magna as well off the ball, just gave Milan a bit more of unpredictability in the final third. He touched by Hernandez, flighted in back post. A little confusion at the oh. back! And just like that, seconds after the restart, Brahim Diaz on the board. From the locker room to the score sheet. It's Milan 3, Udinese 2. Look at this switch here. That is beautiful work. Teo Hernandez acres of space. He's got all the time in the world to measure this cross to the back post. He's actually looking for Junior Macias. I have no idea what this touches right here. That was Perez. It's a header down. He nearly scores an own goal. I, he was trying to glance that one out for a corner kick. He gets all of his angles wrong, and that's what gives Brain Diaz the chance at the near post. All he has to do. Fatigue as much as anything for the change. Macias in a battle with Pereira. Taken back by Ibrahim Diaz. Dragged across. Rubic! He's done it again! Giving the opportunity, and he's taking full advantage. Ante Rebic gives Milan breathing room. Really good balance from him after Macias is just able to poke it away. Brahim pounces on and he just plays that right ball right across that six yard box. Knows he has two options, far post. Pereira just cannot get rid of it. Brahim's right there and he plays a really smart ball. Good awareness for 
such a quick time to react and figure out where he's going next. It seemed like the ball was nearly stuck under his feet, but he found a way to get it free, played across. Remember, he had a hand in setting up that first goal.